A native of Germany, Naumer was inspired to travel to the southwestern United States by the books of Karl May, a prolific German writer whose depictions of America's mythic Wild West captivated European audiences through much of the first half of the 20th century. In the mid-1920s, Naumer traveled from New York to Los Angeles with limited funds, finally joining the Merchant Marines as a means of financing further adventures. Naumer settled in Santa Fe in the 1930s, where his career was bolstered by a WPA grant, commissioning him to create a visual record of the cliff dwellings at Frijoles Canyon, now Bandelier National Monument, and the Pueblos of northern New Mexico. In the artistic environment of Santa Fe, Naumer befriended several local artists. He began painting landscapes and was fascinated by the striking characteristics of the surrounding mountains. Serrated mountaintops and the chasms between them caught his eye and stirred his emotions. His favorite medium was pastel, although he also worked in oil and watercolor. With pastels, he did not have to waste time mixing colors or worry about colors fading over time. Pastels were ideal for catching the fleeting effects of sky and earth of the New Mexico landscape with the fast-changing colors that sweep across them. Naumer became adept at discreetly cataloging the particulars of a scene and then fitting them together in a discriminating manner so as to evoke the essential qualities of a first-hand encounter with nature. His mature visions of the Southwest are both formally integrated and romantic, and also are a valuable historical document of that time. This rare achievement was one that earned him critical acclaim and attracted the attention of collectors throughout the country.